Here we are again. We are still in the Black Horse Tavern and we'd like to show you a few more things before we end our tour of this tavern. Here we have two portraits by an unknown artist featuring Mr. and Mrs. Sterling. The gentleman is Jonathan Sterling and the lady is his wife, Mary Ann. The Sterlings were a very prominent family in the area of Mason Town. As you can see in the photos, the period uh, dress that they are have a their attire for the for the picture uh, would be appropriate for someone who had a little wealth and prominence in the town, such as the Sterlings did. Mr. Sterling was born in May uh, 29th, 1820, and passed away August 8th, 1881, at the age of 61. His wife, Mary Ann, was born August 2nd, 1819, and she passed away December 21st, 1904, at the age of 85. The um, area near Mason Town along the Monongahela River was named, is named Mount Sterling and is named after the family estate. Unlike today, most people could not be remembered through photographs, so we see actually two fine examples by the artist. If we actually look at their facial features, uh, there's a lot of dimension and depth in the facial, facial features but you'll notice that the artist has spent less time on the clothing. He's done a very good job, in my opinion, of the face and the hands on both individuals. And then our last person of interest in this room, as she watches for her husband to come home, he is on a riverboat working in Mississippi. She's waiting on him to come back. Last heard, he was in New Orleans. So she stands here in the Black Horse Tavern, which is often the case of many wives and girlfriends waiting for their loved ones to come home. Unfortunately um, for Amelia Hook, her husband does not come home. Peter Hook was killed on the riverboat and buried along the shore somewhere close to New Orleans. So she stands here awaiting his return, but unfortunately tonight she, he will not be returning home as planned. We would like to thank you for watching. Please continue to support us at the Abel Collie Tavern and Museum. Thank you.